last three starts. Two of them were in overtime. Able to get his team some points on the other end. It's Eunice Corpus Allo first year in a Senator's sweater. He's really struggled. Some 900 save percentage. The volume might be what gets it done here tonight. Everything at the Ottawa goal. Senators dead last in the NHL with an 88.4 team save percentage. That's well, he also hit the pole, so it would have been the biggest goal of the season. It would have been the first against Vegas there. Kachuk with a shot right on. Middleton for Faber. He relays it ahead to Zuccarello. He couldn't get it out of the zone, and a tip shot out front by Joseph is held by Fleury. Yeah, they get a lot of power play opportunities, too. Third most power play opportunities for Ottawa. They, they draw a lot. Here comes Goudreau shorthanded. Goudreau from a sharp angle and a save by Corpusalo. Brandstrom sends it back up to the line. Giroux into the middle. Pinto a shot and a save by Fleury. Brodine back defensively for Minnesota, able to knock it away from Bernard Docker. And Shaw carries to center. Bogosian, center, Shaw scores! Scoring, they get a goal from the fourth line here to put him in front. Yeah, how about this feed from Bogosian? He just feathers this one across the zone over three sticks, lands it flat on Shaw's tape, and he just has to redirect this one in. Corpus Allo following the pace of this puck doesn't get over fast enough, and there's a little daylight five hole that Shaw finds for him. And Flurry gives it to Chisholm. Boy, he puts Shaw in a tough spot. It leads to a turnover. Flurry has to make a save. Merrill on it there for Minnesota. Reverses it back to Letary. Lucini picked up the second assist on the Minnesota goal. And the Wild in front 1-0. Wild have been good when they score first in games this year. 26-8-4. Johansson circles out from behind the net. Into the high slot. Rossi a shot save. Corpusalo. Emotions boiled over. It was a, a poor choice. He absolutely owned it. He said he'll take the suspension and hope that his club can get three wins and let him get back in there and continue playing. And it deflects all the way back off the center ice. Bernard Docker carries in. Kachuk in the high slot. A blocker saved by Fleury. Goudreau at center ice. Beckman with a shot. It seemed to fool Corpusalo. Um, Coach Pat Dwyer says he grew up there. Just wasn't born there, but he counts it. Merrill with a shot, and it's held by Corpusalo. Drew wins it cleanly. Stutzla fires, and a save by Fleury. Good spot, but a great illustration of why that rule was put into place. Another shot off of the next draw. Then Kachuk had a whack at the rebound, and the Senators show you just how much can happen in 10 seconds they get you had set off the top you thought the wild needed to take advantage of every opportunity to shoot the puck don't pass them up against a goaltender who struggled all year they had just eight attempts in the first 20 minutes now, I think they probably had eight attempts to the back post somebody driving there and throwing it across the crease they connect on one Mason Shaw goal but I think that they can throw a few more off the paths and generate some chaos around Ottawa's net. Flurry has to make a shoulder save on the first attempt of the second period. Averaged about two thirds of a shot on goal per game this year up over two shots per night. And then probably the location of them is what stands out most to me. He, he seems to be right around the paint and as for generating his offense. And they score! A line that had come close so many times in the first period. Matt Boley beats Corpusalo, and Minnesota has a two-goal lead. Don't do it against this Ottawa club. Forward check, and Kaprizov collects his puck. Backhand pass right to the slot on the tape of Matt Boldy. And I don't even think he takes a look up. He just fires this thing towards Corpusalo. More goals per 60 minutes than any trio in the league, and that includes McKinnon's line in Colorado, McDavid's line in Edmonton. Here's Beckman on the backhand, saved by Corpusalo. Some good back pressure creates a loose puck. 
Rossi, Johansson, Zuccarello a shot. Sliding save, Corpusolo. Matt Boldy with a goal for Minnesota. Matt Zuccarello nearly added here. Luce now collides with Chisholm. That creates a loose puck that's scooped up by the Senators. Giroux plays it ahead for Joseph. Back to Giroux. He fires right on. And gives it to Sanderson up high. Back for Stutzla. To the side of the net, Batherson. Stutzla off the post. Rebound scooped up by Sanderson. He reverses to Chikrin. Couple of offensive-minded defensemen here for Ottawa. Kachuk across. Batherson scores. They got the seam pass they were looking for earlier in the sequence, and this time Sanderson, or rather Batherson, beats Flurry, and it's 2-1. When Kachuk collects this one, it's no look through to the back side. Batherson, goal scorer, he puts that one upstairs. But it's favor. Maybe caught kind of in no man's land right in front of the net, not laying down, just trying to block that pass. And Kachuk surprised him a little bit with a no looker right. Got a stick on another clearing attempt, but it's scooped up and carried to center by Kastelik. Flurry knocks this one to the boards. Greg carries in for Ottawa. Back to Kachuk. His shot right on is held by Flurry. For anything in the standings, and you're right. Head coach Dean Evison coached just one more game once the team came back. A loss in Detroit. Johansson wins a battle along the wall. Out to Middleton. Faber in the middle. Back for Johansson. A shot kicked to the corner by Corpusalo. And Brandstrom comes up with a puck. Zuccarello got a stick on it. Brandstrom couldn't get it by Zuccarello at the line. Clevin moves into the Minnesota zone. Back to Kubalik. And a long shot is gloved by Fleury. Wild started play tonight with nine games remaining. The Kings have eight. And the Wild eight points behind Los Angeles. Sanderson to Kachuk in the corner. A centering pass, a backhander off the stick of Castellet flutters into the mitt of Fleury. Greg carries in for Ottawa. Has Kachuk with him a shot, saved by Fleury. Rebound scooped up by Erickson Eck. And an important one here for the Wild to start with possession on the power play. And Giroux wins another one. Matherson, the power play goal earlier in the game, gives it to Stutzla. Stutzla. Centers, Chikrin scores, and another power play goal for the Senators. Another on which Fleury has no chance, and Ottawa ties it 2 2. And then it just bounces over a stick as Middleton tried to clear it. Ottawa goes to change sides. They get their set up, and they've attacked from low. And it's Brady Kachuk, who rightfully so, he leads this club in power play goals. He slides up to the slot. Giroux pressuring, and his pass is tipped away. Here comes Ridley Gregg, shorthanded. Gregg beats Kaprizov in, and a pass saved by Flurry. But this still a 2-2 game because of the save from Marc-Andre Flurry. Ridley Gregg goes to the backhand. and Around for Kaprizov. Off the boards and out to Chisholm. Pusnadinov. Waiting, looking, centers, Erickson not going to save by Corpusolo. Looking for the puck. That's the first chance. Back with the second opportunity, and Corpusolo's down. Referee doesn't see it there, but it's through him on the weak side. Batherson trying to drop it back to Pinto. Poke checked away by Letary. Those two tangle at center. Shaw on the loose puck. Trying to chip it by Branstrom. Branstrom goes to the ice. Letary scores! for the fourth line for Minnesota, and they lead it 3-2. There's Batherson, and then he didn't come back hard enough. Miscommunication on who was going to retrieve that puck. That allowed Shaw to get on their forecheck, turn it over. And Branson's like, ah, I don't want to get this. I'm in a bad spot now. Shaw wins that battle. They get a fortuitous bounce to the slot. It ends up on the Terry stick.
And this will bring us to the close. The Wild respond to a couple of power play goals by Ottawa that tied the game and win it on a goal by.